We have breaking news. An Easter morning filled with violence. A deadly mass shooting on the north side. Two juveniles dead. A dozen other injured. And hundreds scatter after bullets fly at an underaged party. The gunman is still on the run. Now, Bryant Reed is at the scene for us right now. And Bryant, a chaotic morning for police and a scary one for neighbors and those involved. So what does the community look like right now? Is everyone safe? And what can you tell us? Well, Brandon, when we first pulled up, police were still doing and they were still investigating the scene. Not too many neighbors are outside right now, as you can imagine, as a neighborhood might be after an extremely scary situation like this. As you mentioned, uh, 11 gunshot victims so far, even more injured through other means. Now, we do have video that takes us inside of that party. The moments any shooting started to happen, go ahead and take a listen. Now, as you hear that screaming, you can, you can just only imagine what those people are going through at that moment. Uh, police say just after midnight, they got shot spotter alerts from this area. And when they showed up, heavy shooting was still going on. Now, this building where the shooting happened is an Airbnb where about 200 people were, were reported partying. Police say many of them were underage. Officers were able to find at least 11 gunshot victims. Two of them, Brianna, as you mentioned, were both male juveniles. They died of their injuries at the hospital. Now, Brianna, Pittsburgh police say about 50 rounds were fired during this intense shootout. I want to go ahead and show you these windows that are broken out because in trying to get away from uh, the, the gunshots flying, people were jumping out of the windows of this building in order to get to safety. And of course, as you can imagine, ended up with un other injuries like scrapes, bruises, and bro broken bones. And uh, those are some of the details that we know at this moment. But as we continue to learn more and talk to neighbors and uh, hear from the community, we'll make sure to keep you updated. Reporting live, I'm Brian Reed, KDKA News. And that video, it's hard to watch and listen to. Thanks, Bryant. And we'll provide you with updates all morning long on this mass shooting. Keep it here on air and online at KDK.com and on the CBS News Pittsburgh app for the developments.